What's going on my dudes one step here with another Mortal Kombat 1 video showing you today what micro ducking is and how to implement it in your gameplay so that way you can become the better punisher in Mortal Kombat 1. Micro ducking is a uh, kind of an advanced strategy so if you're a beginner this might be kind of hard to really get down and it's kind of hard to practice but I'm going to show you how to do so so again that way you can get better at it. If you don't know this is ducking in Mortal Kombat you just hold down and that is different than holding down and blocking and I'll explain the difference why in a second but as you might have already already guessed micro ducking is the act of quite literally just ducking for like a microsecond very quick very fast and the reason why you want to micro duck is because that way if you duck a high move for an example you're standing back up relatively fast to be able to punish your opponent again just faster so that way they can't block before you can punish them now why is ducking different than like holding down and then blocking well i made a video a little bit ago explaining that mortal kombat has four different uh, attacks they got lows they got mids they got highs and they got overheads so that's four different ways to attack when you're ducking you're going to duck the high moves so just like this you're ducking and uh, and i'm doing a high the high is not going to actually hit you but if i throw out the mid the mid will hit you now the reason why that matters is because if you're ducking and then you block you're essentially throwing your shield up to the high point so my opponent's going to walk up and grab me i'm just going to duck right here he's not going to grab me because the grab is grabbing at the high point but if i'm ducking and blocking i'm throwing my block essential shield up to the high point so I will get grabbed and that works for any highs now obviously if you're ducking and I throw in the overhead you're gonna get hit by the overhead so ducking is is only meant for high attacks but that's okay because a lot of attacks are highs and a lot of character strings start with a high most strings in Mortal Kombat start with a high then go mid so this one right here one two is a high mid a lot of characters have a strain that are just like that a few exceptions are characters like Johnny that have a really fast starting mid that is one of the reasons why Johnny Cage is so good in this game is having a really good fast starting mid is just an amazing tool for this exact reason you can't duck it and it's fast raiden has forward two and that is a mid but that is 18 frames on startup yeah it's decently fast but it's not nine or ten frames and that's also why you see a lot of people go for the d1 because that is a good fast mid you can't really combo from that but it's a good interrupter move which again is why you see a lot of people go for the uh the pokes now where does micro ducking come into play in all of this micro ducking again is the same of uh, you reading, you're calling your opponent. You're essentially making a very educated guess that they're gonna go for the grab. They're gonna go for a high starting string. You're going to either duck that first hit or duck the grab. And then as soon as you see them with the grab, with that first hit, you go in for the punish. You interrupt their string for the punish or you just punish them from whiffing the grab. Now it's a double-edged sword because you're not blocking. Remember, you're only ducking, you're actually not blocking. So if they throw out the mid, you're gonna get hit and you're just gonna get blown up. So right now, Omni Man is set to do doing a high mid high string a grab or a mid i'm going to duck and punish the the two options that i can duck and if i see the mid coming i'm gonna block it so it'll look just like this so you saw right there, I immediately recognized that he whiffed a high because I was ducking and I went right for the punish. I used one, two because that is my fastest string. So it's my fastest punish. Let's try it again. Again, I saw that he whiffed that high. He's going for the high, mid, high string. I was able to interrupt him between his one, two. He whiffed the one before his two would come out. I did my string, thus punishing him. There's the mid I saw coming out. So there it is. If I'm ducking and not blocking, that mid's going to hit me regardless. So it's a trade-off because you're betting that your opponent is going to do a high or a grab. So if you see him walking towards you and you think they're going to grab you, just duck it and then punish him. The point here is to be very fast. The problem is, is if you're too fast, you're going to stand back up too fast to the point where you're early. So the grab will connect or the high will connect. If you truly want to be fast micro duck like this, <laughs> it's going to take very precise timing. Most of the time, you're going to see a lot of people just like duck like this. And that is still fast, but not quite that fast, right? Like you're going to duck for a second and then go back up. So like this, I'm going to try to micro duck it. I missed too, too slow. Let's try it again. Ah, too early. Do it again. Too early. There we go. So what I recommend doing to practice micro ducking and get better at it is get a character, Omni Man, Raiden, Scorpion, who, like, whoever you want to get. Go to the playback recording and the opponent type. Set one of them to be the, you know, one, two, two, or whatever their high mid string is. Set one of them is to uh, grab. And then set one of them to be their mid. Then go for the playback trigger and just do random. And then what you want to do is you just want to go and duck them and then see if you can punish them. If they try the mid, uh, try blocking it and react in time. Here we go. 
there we go it's gonna take some time to really master but even like this is a strategy that even i'm trying to work on and get better at because it's just such a powerful tool especially the higher levels if this video helped you understand and get better at micro ducking make sure you give it a thumbs up subscribe here for more mortal kombat and fighting game content take it one step at a time and go ahead and click into these videos next for more mortal kombat news guides reactions and more